What's up, everyone? You are tuned in to the Channel Eeps episode 119. I'm your host, Eepmon, because there is none other. I just came back, folks, from an all you can eat sushi restaurant. And I am so full. Oh my God. I always do this to myself. I always like go way overboard to the point that I'm walking back home and I'm limping. I'm literally limping because I have so much. I ate so much. Like that being said, I don't go to these all you can eat indulgements um, all the time. I do it once in the blue moon. But for some reason today, I said, you know what? I'm going to treat myself. I am going to treat myself. And I did. And uh, I sort of regret it now. I probably need to do a little bit of some laps just to like uh, work on the digestion. (laughs) Oh, my God. (laughs) Anywho, uh, getting off track. Um, What am I going to talk about today? Today, I am going to talk about the life of an entrepreneur and it never ends because uh yeah it's just the way we are i want to talk about this new initiative that being said that i started earlier this year with my co-founder killjoy he is the web3 builder solidity developer and eepverse is the I guess my vision of the world of eeps something that I created that I envisioned a long time ago where I have my own eep characters, you know, my own worlds, my own universes. And I felt that with the advent of The new technologies that are emerging, such as Web3, blockchain. You notice that I'm talking, I feel kind of still full. So I'm like, I'm just trying to be careful not to go too hard on myself. Uh, But yeah, so with with blockchain and Web3, very much a new medium, new technology. And I get it. Not many people understand it. But for uh, for one who has uh, dwelled in, uh, delve, delve in, delve, delve delve into the world of nfts and uh, blockchain back in 2020 uh during the whole euphora of that space um i have uh witnessed firsthand and experienced why this new technology will become such a big big deal I feel that right now where we are with web three is how, you know, the, how it was in the very beginnings of web two or even the beginnings of web one. It's such a nascent technology at the moment that with any cycle of any new, uh, introduction of a technology will always have the early adopters and then mainstream adoption and then of course followed by the the laggards i've seen this many times and i have witnessed the same usual suspects who deny deny they hate it they hate it deny and then eventually they follow the fold because folks let's face it it is part of the technological progression, right? It's just so happens that technology progresses and opportunity moves in that vector direction. Um, So anyway, I've digressed a lot, but Eepverse, I felt that to truly, from what I have witnessed in other community-based blockchain um, um, platforms, I do feel that the time is right to launch Eepers, which I did earlier this year, and to continue to spearhead it in, in, in new directions. 
new collaborations, partnerships, and whatnot. So I thought I'd do a little bit of a show and tell. I know I'm five minutes in. I think I've ranted too too much, but uh, I have to be better at these timings and all that. But I want to show you my Instagram account at Eatmon, and uh, I've really you know it was we're just building, folks, right? Like Killjoy and I are just building, and uh, I was very pleased to find out that Eatverse, uh, we're using this. Um, this technology called patchwork. They're, they're, uh, patchwork is like really, it's a, is, is a, I don't think it's an organization. They're, they're like basically like us, like just like a bunch of dudes who just created this new way of making um, a layer that wraps around uh, ERC 721s, NFTs kind of thing. And it, which gives additional, how do I say um, gamification perhaps, or the, it, it adds these additional um, features and utilities to make development and, and um, uh, NFTs more accessible. And yeah, it's, it's just like a platform play is what it is. And uh, we, we, Everse is powered by patchwork. In fact, uh, in the I'm not I'm not the coder, so Killjoy is the coder guy. But in my um, understanding, you know, and you know, the patch we are leveraging Patchworks technology because what's really special about what we do with Eatverse, like you notice that if you had Eat Monkey, <coughs> excuse me, if you had Eat Monkey, uh, you could equip Eat Monkey wearing different apparel, different, you know. Um, uh, it could be a hoodie, it could be a pant, and you you'll see that you can actually equip that through our eFirst website. And it might sound very simple, yeah, you're just dressing up the the monkey, eat monkey with different things. But in fact, the underlying what goes behind the scenes is actually quite complicated. Is actually quite um, like technically, like speaking, it is pretty cool. Like it's it's actually a really amazing thing in what we have achieved and it is all to thanks because of the patchwork dudes who provided this um this technology that makes it uh more accessible for us to uh, for for killjoy and developers to to uh, to do these things to equip other and with the, the idea of nfts equipping with other nfts like so in layman's term basically what what this technology is is that one NFT can own other NFTs in a very hierarchical structure. So if hypothetically speaking, Eat Monkey is the top, top level NFT, and then what's Eat Monkey wearing? Oh, is it a hoodie? Is it a shirt? Is it a sh sneakers? Then it is a branch off of the Eat Monkey route. And then it can even just go down to many, many levels. That is really cool that uh skeletal structure to enable nfts to absorb other nfts is 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 um i see so much promise and potential and here we are the ability to to equip eat monkey with different things now there was a bounty i'll get to the chase sorry i'm, I'm just really stretching this so long um there's a there was a bounty and a competition of like whoever can create the amazing experience using password technology is eligible to win prizes. And I'm really pleased to say that we got first place for this competition. And and we, you know, we got a small prize money of three thousand USDC stable coin. But it does show that we are making mark our mark. We are progressing and people are noticing and appreciating what we're doing in the space. And that's fantastic. And that's that's all I ever want wanted is to use cool technology, launch Everse, and be part of this new movement uh, of this like of, of Web three and Web three and blockchain. So I thought I'd share that with you. Um, and here a little sneak peek. I'm really excited about this. I just recorded this, but essentially we're going to add expressions 
to eat muggy. So <laughs> we have an, ar an array of different uh, expression, facial expressions, which you can equip monk eat monkey um, in different assortments. So that's going to be really cool. And again, this has all to do with the whole hierarchical structure of of uh, of of Patchworks technology. But yeah, I thought I, th I thought I'd just show you, have a bit of fun here. Again, as you see in the, in our past, we've uh, done a couple of uh, IRL events beyond blockchain, and then before that was Art Engine, and I believe we are going to do another event on October first at um, Web Three Ottawa. But I do have to finalize the details uh, regards to that. But yeah, it's it's coming close because like October first is around a quarter, but then. I'm I'm traveling to Japan on October second, so I just don't know if I if I have time to to make this happen. Well, if Killjoy will probably like will 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 be there in like regardless if I'm there or not. Here's like more. Here's a really cool sample. Like here's the NFT hoodie, the NFT color palette that defines Eat Monkey, and then Eat Monkey itself. Really cool technology. Excuse me. I'm so full. Oh my god. Anyway, this episode is gonna be so whack because it's like I'm kind of like passing out and talking about NFTs and stuff. I don't even know if my audience be <laughs> my audience is gonna care. But <coughs> excuse me. Well, but the thing is, is that um, you see. This is what I got to do. These are the things that come natural to me that en that I enjoy. But at the same time, um, this is a a true authentic example of venturing to, uh, towards a new space, a new medium, a new uh, uh, path into something um, uh, that may or may not work. Let's be frank here. Let's let's be let's be truthful. Uh, but the only way that that I can tell, or what how I will find out, is I go through it. I gotta go and make these opportunities, build build eat first, and see how and where I could uh, expand and scale eat first to other um, um, communities, industry, other web three projects. It's it, this is literally this is this is a startup, hundred percent. Um, now of course, like you know, it comes to the monetary value. Well, we're just getting started. Like you know, we're we're doing this for because we love doing it. Um, if it gets picked up down the road, that would be amazing. But my currently my main mandate, my mission is not to like make a killing. It's really to build some really cool stuff. It's like modern day, let's build stuff in a garage or modern day garage, which is not a garage, it's just my place. But like, you know what I'm saying? It's like, let's make shit up. Let's put shit together. Uh, and and um, for, because one, we are engaged with, with uh, new technology. Uh, it's such a, a ripe, uh, such a ripe industry it's just so new that uh, it kind of felt like back in the day when flash was around you could just do any sort of cool thing and it'd be so cool anyway just the fact that you're doing it that's how i feel right now that's why i'm very excited about e uh, everse nfts and all that kind of stuff but yeah i thought i would give a spiel about that um I'm just I'm really I'm, I'm I think my my dynamic with Killjoy has been phenomenal. It's great, and I think there's be some great uh, opportunities coming down. I'm so glad that September's here now. Everyone's back from vacation. People are back to school, and now we can really dial in and 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 get work done. So, looking forward to it. Anyway, uh, that being said, I just want to keep this short. It's Friday, and I'm about to pass up because I'm 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 so full right now. I Maybe mean, I should just drink a big like chug down a earl gray tea or something um but yeah please like and subscribe if, if you have any questions please comment below 
And uh, until next time, this is the Chad Eves episode 119. Have a great evening. Have a great afternoon. Have a great morning anywhere in the world. I just literally ranted this entire episode. I hope you don't mind. I hope you don't mind. But, you know, sometimes you got to rant. You got to rant. You know what I'm saying? Okay. See you later. Bye.